My timeline has been pretty full of people welcoming Deep Seek's model and saying that actually this could be a really good thing for the climate. Having more efficient AI models that can do more while using less computing power and also use less electricity, I think technically that should be a good thing. I think maybe the challenge or complicating factor is that sometimes when you improve things and make things more technologically efficient, that can actually increase overall demand for this technology and that can actually lead to an increase in overall consumption of resources. This is the aspect I really think people should talk about more because we often hear AI touted and in some ways it's true that it will be able to sort of make efficiency gains like we've seen in, in Amazon warehouses and stuff and help climate change. But it's feeling a bit like an oil company saying uh, we, we just need to keep prospecting for oil mm. to so that we can invest in renewable energy. I mean, the carbon footprint of AI is astonishing, isn't it? And we only have so much time kind of before the climate starts getting much worse. And at some point, these companies and tech CEOs will have to really start showing results. There's only so much time that we can kind of plough money into this with nothing to show for but it. But people are going to be too hooked on using AI at all aspects of their jobs and lives. That, that's what they're trying to do. They're trying to weave it into every aspect of Google, Gmail, like it's, it's everywhere.